Facebook friends. I'm no scientist. Neither do I, 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 neither what I want to say. I'm anything in the field of knowing certain things. I'm just here to report what I, I'm seeing. There's a new phenomenon in in the Caribbean islands, I think, I must say, because I think Barbados has the same problem. I saw some footage of this sort of thing on our beach. They call it the seaweed. And in my time, we used to have what the sea, what the people say, the sea farm it up. So we used to have that, but not to this extent. I hope scientists are looking into this, the reason why something like this is happening on our seashores. If you look in the water, mixed with the dirt from the, from the airport construction, there's also a lot of seaweed that is coming in. But this here is puzzling to me. It never used to happen in this region. Well, if it used to happen in this region, not at this magnitude. You look in the distance and the whole beach, the entire beach that is, is covered almost in seaweed. There's some reason why the sea is giving up these weeds. There, must, there should be a quick investigation into something like this. We don't know if it's global, it comes from global warming. Um, oh, I don't know. I don't want to be sung in silly. So I guess I'll just leave the professionals who are on our page to comment on this. But this new phenomenon where seaweeds are on our shores, and I, I think this is this happening on the windward side more so. And I am at sub speech here for you, those of you who want to know. And in the distance, right up to the end of the beach, the seaweed, seaweeds, covering more than half of the, sh the sh sh show. Lots of them. Let's just look, have a close look at this weed and how thick it is underground. So let's see if I could pick up some. That's some in my hand there. You get an idea of how much. It's lots of seaweed. Thank you, my friends.